We may be about to find a new or hidden way to pop lead balloons in Balloon City 6. Let me explain. This is round 28 with only one monkey, but what's insane is the win rate is less than 1% and only 85 people have even beaten it out of 6,000. So how do that many people not know how to pop lead balloons? It must be a hidden way that nobody even thinks about. So we do have regrow lead balloons and the regrow rate is 1500%. But I would say it's glue, right? Glue's always good, but we actually have no way of popping with glue because we're very limited on our tiers. So let's take a look at what we got here. Our only lead popping at this time is going to be the top path ice. And honestly, it looks like that's it. Unless the beast handler, let's try the ice first and see if that's just something that I'm not really understanding. Cause this should be, no, do you have to have the second one? You need the second tier to even pop lead with the ice. Oh my goodness. So the only one that I think can even pop it is the beast handler. Is that true? No, even the beast handler can't do it. So literally nothing can pop the lead unless there's something to do with like carpet of spikes. And I just don't know about it. So let's give that, a... oh, we don't have enough money for it. See, there's just a problem around every single corner with this i'm telling you quick little side note here if you guys are ever in need of monkey money monkey knowledge or just anything in the ninja kiwi store don't forget to use creator support code doubloon and double check your settings to make sure that it's still there because it likes to reset every now and then now one that might kind of elude me is this one because it does have those bombs that come out for the moab but i don't think it helps pop leads yeah no you'd think it would but for some reason it doesn't and the fifth tier sniper used to be able to pop lead but we can't get the fifth tier anyway. But there was a time when I believe it was any fourth tier actually would automatically make that tower pop lead. And then they had to change it because this one got way too OP. So that's not an answer. Well, this is turning into a lot of work. Except for Benjamin. Da -da 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 -da. Okay, okay. Trojan. We have a Trojan. So if he Trojans them all, what good does that do for us? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Because we'd have to sell. And we can't do that. Like that literally does absolutely nothing. Like if I use the ability, does it do anything? How are they not... Hang on, what the heck is happening? If you're as confused as I am, let me know by hitting that like button. Helps spread the channel all across the Bloons community. Now, I know that Benjamin helps pop leads. Like once you Trojan them, it's just like with the Moab to where all you have to do is destroy the Moab and it goes away. But why is that making it to where he can just disintegrate them in one go? Like how are they only taking one life? We have seven, but somehow it's dip like, okay, look it, that's only one life each. That makes absolutely no sense. That doesn't work that way with the Moab. This is why I love Challenge Editor though. It opens your eyes to new things in the game. I'm gonna use just a regular round 40 Moab because I wanna test if that same thing applies to Moab. So I've given myself two lives. Technically when we lose this one, it should go to one. If that's the case, I have never, ever, ever noticed or seen that. See, it doesn't make sense. It doesn't work for the Moab. That's just not a thing. But why does that work for lead though? That literally makes no sense. All of you balloon experts, please let me know below. We just need to make this attack a little bit faster. So I'm guessing, does that make me attack faster? No, right? Doesn't send out Trojans any quicker. So it's this one right here. That's the problem. So how do we make that one? Go, go, go. Okay, I'll put him at the bottom then because he seems to be an issue. So if I place it right here, we should be good. See, that also tells me too, like in the future, I need to pay attention and see like, okay, it's a different hero. We should rule out hero first, rule out glue gunner and always rule out top path village because that's always the answer. And then you can kind of start playing around with things. But can we get this one? Yes, because it's going to be right there. It has to. Okay, that's it. How is that the answer? That makes no sense whatsoever. That is a new way to pop camo. That is a new way to pop lead for sure. Speaking of a Moab, let's give this one a go. Oh no, a Moab less than 1%. And everything is maxed to as far as you can possibly get it. This is going to be a doozy. But I'm feeling good about it just because we learned something new today. When you learn something new, knowledge is power. And that's all I have to say. Knowledge is power. Can we use my Sada or is that the Sada that I have? So it probably won't be that great. So my first instinct is to just get a sniper and make sure that thing goes away. Because doesn't this one shot it? Well, then it's going to be camo underneath, right? I mean, is that really that big of a deal? Well, he can one shot camo. So just don't shrapnel shot it. And that's it. Please tell me there's more than that. So I mean, come on guys. And then I can village it to make him a little bit faster. That's not it, right? No way. Two, three. Okay. He's a little too slow. Oh, duh. Just make him faster. I can just make him faster. Like we don't need to get that one. And then it'll work for sure. One more. That's, that's, that's less than 1%. That's less than 1%. That's what I don't understand about this game. How come some of these will keep me here for hours, but others are just so simple. So then I get a big head and we get wrecked on like this one, round 63. What could be so difficult? It's less than 1%. It doesn't matter. I'm too good for this. But I have Churchill and we just learned that we got to rule out our heroes first. So we're going to get Churchill all the way up and see if that matters at all. Dude, 
Dude, come on. How are we going to take this out? This is already just insanity. I don't like it. I don't like it at all. So I'm going to go with this one because I really like this tower. And when you get and it pops lead, like that's really good, right? So then you just go like blah, 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 blah. And that's first one done. And then I could, oh my gosh, you can just keep doing that. Oh my gosh, you can just keep doing that. But we have to be obviously quicker about it for sure. And then just do that right now. That's easy. Oh my goodness. Okay, that's game. So we're going to wait for it, hit it, and then hit it again. I need to be quicker with this stuff though because the second rush is gonna come out and just wreck us. Then hit it now, let's see if that works. Where's the rush at? Why is the rush so slow? Come on, buddy. I mean, 20 years later, <laughs> that's ridiculous. I'm wondering if I can glue everything and just like keep it glued forever, right? And then what we'll do is we'll use this one and now we can't make any mistakes here, right? Because everything's glued, I think. I think that's how that works or not, or not, or not, okay. No, that was actually really bad. Okay, here we go, even better. I can just do this one. Oh, I need the hot spikes. We'll just go like blah, 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 and then do it again. And then just do it again. Yeah, that's the answer right there. That's super simple stuff here. I mean, this is like child's play. How did I not know about this? Why is it 1% though? I just don't get that. I don't get why it's less than 1% when it's this easy. And I have three of them and there's three rushes. Like voila, you know, like just boom, done, game over. I can use another one. That's Victor. What the heck? These are less than 1% and we're just tearing them up. I'm going to get way too difficult here and then just be very upset about it, but we're going to do it again. Another really difficult one. This one's even way more difficult. Less than 1%, round 36, all camo, all regrow, of course. Well, I think it's actually just alternate balloon rounds 36. That's why it was called ABR 36. Makes sense. And then we're just going to try to snipe everything. Like just straight up snipe it, get it in a cool spot. Dude, that was beautiful. That was poetic. Oh my goodness. I don't like shooting backwards, but I mean, you gotta do what you gotta do. Now hit that one perfectly one shot it. Is there ceramics on 36 since when? Excuse me, sir. Uh, when did there get ceramics on this one? Okay, one more shot. Okay, we can actually do this. I think the sniper is the answer. We'll try the other path instead. Oh yeah, that's actually not bad at all. It's really clean. That one extra shot does so much, that's so crazy. But it's not enough for that though. But you also can't sell, right? So you're stuck with what you got. Oh, but you can buy two towers. So if I shimmer him, oh, I just don't have enough though. Cause I could just buy that one. Maybe, would we have enough? That's a lot of money to carry around. Okay, 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 let's just do this then. It seemed to be working. So we'll go one, two, one, two. That covers all of that. And then we'll snipe this. It's not all camo though, right? So I could just be able to hit it normally. I mean, even if it is, we got camo here. Okay, this is not bad, not bad. Oh, then he pulls up the rug on the fire. God, I hate that. Look, we took the last one out, no problem. But he's like, nah, I'll just, I'll get rid of my fire right now, boss. How do we take out the ceramic though? If I could just knock it down. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. You got this. Okay, that didn't work either. We're so close, but so far away. That's how this game works though. So I feel like the sniper wants to be the answer, but it just, it's so rough. Like right there is great. But then you just got to like, make sure you take, ah, the black ones are the ones that's the crazy ones because then they take too much extra time. So like right now, this will be a two shotter, I think maybe three. And then we got that one, but we need to worry about the ceramics first. And then we'll go back to those ones. That's just not going to work. The faster one was better, but it's not strong enough. Dude, I am having struggle bus problems right now. This is ridiculous. And I can't see camo. Genius. There we go. All right. So let's go with this one and then all the way up there. I know it'll take out the beginning ones, but not the other ones. We have $1,400 left though. So if I could just like slow down the ceramic maybe. Yeah, let's just slow it down. So, okay, we're good. We're good. Get them, glue them. Sort of, sort of, sort of. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding? What can I get? What can I get? Pop them, pop them, pop them. There we go. We got it last second. I was trying to put a glue on the water and the glue doesn't even pop things. I was stupid, but we made it work. This is the last 1% I'm doing. I'm not going to get a big head about this because that's when you fail and you go too far. It's like playing roulette. You always think, oh, the next one's going to be red. Oh, for sure. And then boom, you lose everything. So we are going to do one last one and we're going to call it a day. And it's on one of the worst maps in the game, Bazaar, with $9,999 on round 58. And things cost more money to remove. Dude, I'm not a big fan of 58, let me tell you. So I think the best option for this cruddy map is one of these. Upgrade restricted. Okay, never mind. We'll go with a helicopter. Again, never mind. Let's just see what that does, though. Is anything like lowered? No, everything still kind of sucks. <laughs> like, let's be real. But the cooldown rates are better. That's not bad. So maybe it's just something easy like the Fire Phoenix. 
which we don't have access to. So that, that's not the answer, but maybe what we can do is just flame. Oh, okay. Or just destroy everything in one shot because why not? We have a really cool guy here. Okay. There's no way though. No way he can take that out. So that is going to be death of us is the Moabs. So what's something with a good ability? Spike storm. Okay. And we're left with $99. I don't think that's a coincidence. So we'll just keep doing it over and over and over. Yeah. Just keep doing it. Well, it's easier said than done. All right. So let's try that again, but on this side. Oh, but it spews across the whole track. I think that's the grossness of it. So is that not the answer? That's really weird, right? Like that's a really good tower, but it's being really donkey. So maybe I could just put it in a better spot. Okay. We got that one there. I'm wondering if I should wait till everything's in my face. Like maybe that's the plan here, but we'll get three of them if we play our cards right. And then this one I'll wait for. I'll just hit it right now. Yeah, that worked, right? No, we still have so much left. That's actually really crazy. So let's just try everything. I mean, this could work. Dude, that's real. And he sees through walls and his range is ridiculous. Okay, thank you very much. Yeah, I'll take more. Unless there's some kind of camo popping out that I don't see, this is it. It's just the, oh my goodness. We are wrecking less than 1% challenges. We just did it. Unless something else crazy comes out. That, jeez Louise. I said I wasn't gonna do it, but I got to. This is what I'm saying. I'm, I'm rolling red on roulette. This is another less than 1% challenge. Just as bad, round 33, $1,500. We are destroying less than 1%ers a day. And then there's days that like a 1% will catch me up for hours. But I think it's just gonna be this and just buy up her and then put it in a good spot. So like up here where it just, everybody crossed, like, dude, is this seriously gonna be it? Like we just go like this and then there's no way, right? And you can sell and rebuy it. So I guess if the yellow, like we could just have done that and then do it again. Okay, no, we can't buy it twice. That makes sense. And then the cooldown rate is not that good. I mean, it's not the worst. Maybe we could do it twice. So let's do it once and then see if it comes back. But I don't think it did, right? Not even close. No, no, no. So that's not going to work. How do we keep that low? Well, if we have like this one, I think he'll just do it for us, right? But we don't have camo. Like they knew. They knew ahead of time, right? So how about a sniper? No camo. No camo. No camo. No camo. Does Gyre Falcon see camo? It does not, right? I don't know. I don't use this tower enough, so I do got to try it, unfortunately. <laughs> of course not. No. So I think you need like the second or third tier for that one. Dude, we get no camo with none of these towers. What are we going to do? I'm honestly getting tired of saying no camo. It kind of sounds like one of those funny words. You know, after you say a word enough, it just sounds ridiculous. That's what I feel like right now. How do we buy Gwendolyn? Okay, it has to be the location then. Duh, da 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 da. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna put it like right here. And the reason why I'm saying that is because we gotta find a spot where it's gonna hit all of them at once. So like, right? Okay, that's not gonna work, but you get what I'm saying? Cause now this entire left side will be eaten alive. Oh, we can lose lives? Oh, okay, see? Revelation. So what we're going to do is we're going to see how many we can lose and then just don't do that. So we got one yellow, two yellow, three yellow, four yellow, five yellow. So we can lose five yellows. Okay. So one, four, five yellows. And now we have to hit the sixth one. There we go. That's game. Maybe it's just a simple counting is less than 1%. Dude, I'm Okay. Okay. I'm going to go play the lottery because apparently I'm on fire today and I'm loving it, but I have to stop there. You got to quit when the quitting's good. I think that's the saying. And if you have not yet, check out this video where we have to take on a round 60 BFB with only $5,000. How is it even possible?